If you're adamant about using synthetic division for this problem, just remember this one thing. All right, so if we're first gonna apply our synthetic division, the first thing we need to do is identify our k. We're gonna take our divisor, solve it for x, and when we do that, we're gonna get a negative 3 halves. That is going to be our k. Then what we're simply gonna do is take the coefficients of our dividends to be a 2, negative 3, negative 9. Now apply the long synthetic division algorithm. First number always comes down, that's a freebie. Multiply in the diagonal, add on the vertical. 2 times negative 3 halves is going to be a negative 3. Negative 3 plus negative 3 is going to be a negative 6. Negative 6 times a negative 3 halves. Negative 6 times negative 3 is a positive 18. 2 times 1 is 2. Positive 18 divided by 2 is a positive 9. Remainder is going to be 0. But that is my remainder, my constant, and my linear term. Some students will think it's a 2x minus 6. But ladies and gentlemen, that cannot be my remainder. I have to remember this too. So what we're simply going to do is take this 2x minus 6, divide it by that coefficient, leaving us a final answer of x minus 3, which is going to be our quotient.